Welcome on in everybody to Indigo Park. So, um, this is a game that I've been looking forward to for a long time. I've always seen like a bunch of stuff on YouTube about it. And you look very terrifying there in the background. Um, so yeah, um, I haven't seen anything about this today. I've seen like people y uploading this stuff to YouTube already. Um, I haven't watched anything, so yeah, I'm really excited for this. So why don't we go ahead and get started? Oh, well, no, it is a new game. Yes, it's a new game, game. <laughs> so this game is currently free on Steam right now. This is chapter one. Hey, there's a little guy. Yeah, so chapter one. So this is a free game right now, but definitely, definitely check this game out. For all who journey to this newfound paradise, we welcome you. Indigo Park offers a slice of the American dream to call your own. In this place, echoes of days gone are brought back to life as a new generation captures a glimpse of the exciting potential of tomorrow. Heck Indigo yeah. Park pays homage to the values, dreams, and unwavering truths that gave rise to our great nation. Here you embark on the journey of a lifetime, a place of creativity, oh. joy, and fantasy, where your dreams hold. <laughs> Are you winning? We just started. Also, hello. Welcome on in, Phoenix. Welcome on, Linovir. I'm hoping I'm saying your name right, but welcome on in. The Bluff welcomes you. Another search this weekend. What is it? The last few times I've gone with you sucked. Remember the old theme with the park we went as kids? Indigo Park? Oh, wait. I couldn't read that all. This is not a park entrance. Well, it is now. Oh, so we're a reporter. Okay. Got some CDRs there. Nice, nice. Look at Parkside Enclosure. This music slaps, by the way. Birds of a Feather. What an introduction. I just played this yesterday on stream. Super fun game. Wish it was longer. I had a feeling it was probably a little short because I, because like again, I've seen uh, a couple of YouTube uploads today. I haven't watched anything, but they average around like thirty-five to forty minutes. So that's kind of the reason why that I wanted to jump into this tonight. Because again, I'm looking really forward to this. I have no idea what's in store for me. Seen the little guy on Twitter? Yeah. He's been all over the place. Also... Okay, so some stuff hasn't loaded in yet. Cool. Okay. 35, 30 to 45 minutes. Really? Is that how long it is? Also, hold on. I don't think the game is supposed to look like this, right? Let me just restart the game real quick, chat. Because, again, I don't think the game is supposed to look like that. Again, I don't think the game is supposed to look like this. This probably isn't a great representation of it, but we're going to get straight into it anyway. Let's see. Uh, oh, wait. Are we supposed to go here? Oh. Yes, we are. Hi there! Oh, jeez! Welcome to Indigo Park! The world's most innovative and engaging family fun experience. Jump into the world of your favorite camper. <laughs> Wait, you're our first guest in 2,920 days, 4 hours, 23 minutes, and 38 seconds. Oh. Congratulations! I'm Rambly, Rambly the Raccoon, and it's my job to make sure your experience here at Indigo Park is the most fun it can be. Just hop on over to the registration center to your left, where our friendly assistant will help you begin your adventure in the park. Okay, chat, I like this guy already. Uh, right. You looking like this is developed from a small team of people, so no hate to them. But I think this is a bug that needs to be fixed. Hi, I'm Rambly, Rambly the Raccoon, and it's my job to make sure your experience here at Indigo Park is registered. Let me just get a good look at you. Hmm, <laughs> you don't seem to have your face in our guest list. Is this your first time here at the park, or did you just get plastic surgery? No worries, it's Rambly Tuesday. So you qualify for a big discount on your visit. Oh, wait, Just it's Saturday. <laughs> Ooh, I can't wait for you to see everything Indigo Park has to offer. 
Buddy, I don't know if you know, but that's Saturday, not Tuesday. <laughs> Ba, 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 ba. Hello. What's the hold up? The gate is open. Head on into the entryway. Hmm, hold on. My mistake. The gate is not open. There seems to be an error message being sent from the gate's power unit. Lucky you! You get to be the first person to try our turn on the generator mini rambling venture. Have fun! <laughs> He's so adorable, chat. I love him. Like, I know we haven't gotten very far yet, but... The Indigo Violet Compact Power Generator. But it seems to be inoperable. Looks like it's missing a piece. Can you find it? Like, I know we haven't gotten very far in the game yet, but... I honestly love this character already. Right, now we can plug that in, now we can plug you in. Glad to cut contacts with a certain friend, because now I've met many cute beings like you. Who are you calling cute? I'm not cute. What bark? Yeah, I'm happy to have you with us, friend. Oh, that wasn't. Th was that there before? Okay, hurry up, Mr. Hunt. Welcome to Indigo Park. Ah, uh, I mean, you guys kind of let the place go a little bit. Look at this whole area. Another thing. I okay. Realistically, chat, I could jump over this if I wanted to. <laughs> Silly oh. rambly. Every guest needs a critter cuff that will allow you access to reserve areas, charge payments to your room, and wear a critter cuff. I think there's some. Heck yeah. Shop. Head in there, and I'll get you set up. <laughs> Did let it go to the point of losing textures. <laughs> Listen, we're not here to bully the game tonight, okay? <laughs> That. Look, I mean, we could surely just like yoink it. Go, buddy. Your very own critter cuff. Oh. A new way to interact with the park that also doubles as a pedometer, heart monitor, and moon ring. Data disclosure agreement included. What are you, GLaDOS now? <laughs> okay. Give me this. Wait, hold on. Did you see that guy's arms? I'm not going crazy, am I? But are we like super. Buffed up. Okay. Uh -oh. oh, the door mysteriously locked. Why not test out your band and save the day? <laughs> all right, all right, I see you. Where'd the sun go? A lot of shade being thrown over here. <laughs> Hooray! Great work, buddy. Now try entering the park, and we can start our indigo adventure. Heck yeah, buddy. Yeah, like you can see here, like everything is actually fairly decently modeled. Wait a s are you looking at me? Uh You were looking right at me. Okay, that's a little bit unsettling. Right, um, let me see. Is there anything else over here? Just a bunch of trash, I think. Where did all this crap come from? Did this, like, did this whole place used to have a roof or something? Because holy heck and hecky. It's a level of detail glitch they can fix it. Yeah, I think that's probably what this is because like again I have restarted my laptop. I've reinstalled the game and everything is on high right now and that's after turning it down to from epic. So again, I have no idea why this is what it is, but I mean, hey, it the game just released. So this is probably a bug. Oh. Oh, look. Look, 
chat, the game looks normal. Oh my gosh, wait, I was that just that area that had the level of detail glitch? Because like everything here looks normal. Look, there's you can see the texture, the the geometry, and everything here. Holy heck and hecky! Okay, cool. I think it's just that first area then. All those debris are from the Great Boulder Wars of 1982. Yeah, you, you, you know, I do find it funny that it just magically happened. Uh-oh, uh-oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm not trying to break the game tonight, okay? I, ju I just wanted to play the Rendigo Park. <laughs> okay. Um, I mean, we could take it to- oh my god, wait, it's actually really dark in here. Okay, yeah, I think it's just that first area then, because this whole area looks fine. Uh, for the collectibles, I'm sorry! For the collectibles! Oh, yeah, hey, see? See, sometimes- sometimes you have to take risks, chat. Trapped in a boulder, just like so many soldiers. Wow. Pardon our dust, buddy. Looks like the park is going through some renovations. For the inconvenience, your Ramley Tuesday discount will be three percent off. Why not celebrate oh. this great deal with a ride on my railroad? To test your sleuthing skills, I'll let you find this one all by yourself. Okay. I dig it. I dig it. Are those top comic books right there, or is that? What is that? That looks like a comic book. I can't really tell. Okay, moving on. Rambley's Railroad. You know what this reminds me of, chat? This kind of reminds me of like those really like creepy liminal spaces. Also, wait, you have follow me eyes, don't you? Ah, yeah, see, like he does kind of have follow me eyes. Cool. Cool, cool. The people data suggests you may be a bit older than the target audience for this ride, but it's one of my favorites. Do you know why Rambly the Raccoon loves Rambly's Railroad? Because I like trains. <laughs> I like trains. Okay, but like, I wasn't the only person that saw... You were just over here. I mean, hell, that's that's a great way to lighten the mood. <laughs> yeah, some liberal spaces, like, I can agree, like, they are pretty relaxing. But in some cases, like, where it's kind of like this, it's a little bit creepy. What do you mean there was nothing there? I clearly saw something there. Oh, okay, there we go. Welcome to Rambly's Railroad. I'm Conductor Rambly. Hi, this looks lively. <laughs> oh. Okay. Cool. Oh, look, it's Molly McCaw. It's Molly McCaw, the greatest pilot you ever saw. You sure are, Molly. <laughs> Why, crashing to six bars this week. I'm not what? <gasps> What's barnstorming? Okay, now I know I'm not going fucking crazy. I saw that. You're safe at Indigo Park. Okay, now I know that you're lying. What? Okay. Oh, chat. Okay, no. Now you now you guys are capping. <laughs> I know you guys saw that. Okay, uh, Dead Seagull there. The the thing! The the thing that we're supposed to go up against. Oh, Finley! Come on out and greet the people! Oh! oh. Why the long face and body? You oh, you're a dragon! Always long because I'm always longing. Or no, I think you're an eel. Oh, Finley, you 
should come out of your shell. How about <laughs> <the deal? laughs> My ride, Oceanic Odyssey, will teach you. Oh my god, you all are degenerates. <laughs> it's as blue as me. I hope you'll visit. I'm so lonely. Oh. Oh, but he looks like he. He looks like he can use a friend chat. Whoa, what happened here? <laughs> Jesus. Get the right. Oh, no. What do you mean I have to walk through this all by myself? Hey, who Whoa, who are you? Honestly, your design kind of slaps. Salem, okay. Honestly, Salem's design slaps. Jesus! What happened to you? Cool, cool. Okay, it doesn't look like anything's gonna pop out at me, so... Oh, we need two of those. Oh, there's another thing. Cool. Yeah, nothing is gonna pop out at me, I hope. I'm watching you. Hop back onto the right. Okay. Don't do anything to me. Okay. So we can all be friends here. Jesus. <laughs> Freaking auto door open. What do you mean? Listen, if I know anything about horror games, it's that everything will pop out at you. Common folk name? I am the proud, the prestigious, the professional Lloydford L. Lion, actor extraordinaire! <laughs> Great act, Lloyd. Of Oh my god, I saw that at the last second. That's so freaking evil. Listen, chat, are, are, we just, are we just gonna gloss over the fact that what we just saw was, what just happened? Oh my god, you guys are degenerates. We just saw that fucking thing stare at us from the distance, and y'all are talking. Okay, listen. Listen, I get Lloyd is hot, okay, so, but. What do you think? Pretty fun, right? Now you know all about my friends and Lloyd. Holy crap. Look at this whole place, chat. Can we go in the water? No, we cannot. Yeah, okay. Real question. Like, where did all this stuff come from? There had to be, like, a ceiling or something, right? Straight out of the fall. You know what? I can see that. Like, the water is kind of green. You know what? That reminds me. I, I need to play Fallout again. I played Fallout 4 a couple times on stream, but I don't think we've ever done, like, a complete game run yet. We'll have to play Fallout 4 at some point. This here is an information kiosk. If there's anything around the park you want to ask me about, just stop by here and I'll ramble on about it. Cool. Oh, look, we have, like, some... Okay. I only have eyes for Rambly, so fuck you, Lloyd. <laughs> Honestly, Rambly is really cute. I really love his character in this game, and I love his voice actor. Whoever voice acted for Rambly... You're awesome, and I, I love you. <laughs> Listen, Vitsy. <laughs> I I can't even say it. Okay, let's see. Raction figure. It's the all new Rambly raccoon. Wait, Rambly the raccoon raction figure available at your local toy store. It's cool to see that there's some mint condition ones at the park. Molly plush. I remember when my mom used to. 
took us to the parks one summer. Her favorite was always Molly. So when they first opened the new Molly meet and greet in Jetstream Junction, we were some of the first in line. The sea serpent always kind of freaked- Oh, so he's a sea serpent. Okay, that makes sense. I love aquariums and fish, but the size of him always made me feel uneasy as a kid. I feel like as a kid, Indigo used Lloyd a lot more. It was always one of my favorites. Ah, there's my buddy. It kind of feels like Rambly has a whole empire now, being the main man of Indigo and all. See, I remember watching those old DVDs that Indigo would send to your house when you booked a reservation. They always advertised the biggest gift shops and made all the silly merchandise look so fun. My dad promised he'd buy me a pair when we went. Have I got one? Rambly ears. Those used to fly off the shelves. Oh! That pair is pretty damaged, though. Keep your eyes peeled. There's got to be at least one more mint condition set out there somewhere. Like a yard sale. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Congratulations! You found me! Don't I look adorable? Oh, Chad, I love him. I love Rambly. He, he, he's like, we just met this guy and he's just the cutest thing right now. We just want to know the layout of the park better, right? But see, oh my god. <laughs> Rambly's voice actor. Really? I'll have to watch that later then. <laughs> okay. Real talk. In the later chapters, I hope that they, like, uncover the lore between Rambly and Lloyd. Because, like, yes, we get that he's possibly a really uh, self centered person, but, like, the shade that he's throwing at Lloyd is super funny. Oh, you found my buddy Finley. You know, he's really shy. Like, too shy. Like, I hope that they expand but upon him a bit. Shy. But he's got a good heart. I hope you get to meet him someday. Cool. Okay, Molly plush. Oh, a Molly plush. She's always been my best friend. Did you know she builds planes in her landing pad at the park? And then she crashes them. She's so talented. <laughs> Talented indeed if she's able to, like, pick herself up after each crash. The Lloyd hate is so real. Rambly sounds like an angry ex. Oh, maybe that's it, huh, chat? Oh, oh, I got this. I know the commercial by heart. Wow, it's the unlimited edition Rambly the Raccoon Ratchet figure. Push him down and he jumps. Push him up and he doesn't. It's only $19.99 at your favorite toy store. I mean, that, that screen is a little unsettling, but it's pretty funny at the same time. Let's see. Bird up. Yeah, there's there's the 7-up. Okay, wait. Let's see. Bird up. Kohler. Uh, soda. Dr. Muncher. Kohler. <laughs> and then water and diet water. Okay, so we have 7-up. Uh, Coca-Cola. Uh, a soda. I'm not sure what that is. That could probably be like, it's grape soda for sure. But I, I can't think of the name. Like grape Sierra Mist or something. Uh, Dr Pepper, Diet Coke, water, and then Diet Water. <laughs> yes, Diet Water because water is already so unhealthy for you. Great fan. Oh yeah, you actually might be right. Oh, hello. You're a thing. Cool. Kissing his whole be covered in thick. Ew! <laughs> Why are you doing that, huh? Well, look at that. Oh. You're at Jetstream Junction. Oops. Looks like Jetstream Junction's being tuned up. Last I checked, there's a security office in the back of the theater. Maybe a friendly wrangler can help you get in. Uh, oh wait, oh wait, we already get to see Lloyd in this chapter. Cool. Okay. <laughs> okay. A gold rambly plush. So wait, they were they were so money hungry that they just recolored rambly and called it a new product? Kinda lazy, don't you think? Okay, this one I gotta hear. Wow, is that a limited edition gold Rambly plush? Parents were fighting tooth and nail for those things when they came out. Seriously, our employees had to clean up so many stray teeth and nails. Hard to believe there was all that demand for a regular Rambly plush we just blasted with gold spray paint. <sighs> okay, he's literally talking about like 
every like quote unquote limited edition drop of anything ever. I am I kid you not. Like I see it all over, across like the Facebook marketplace, especially like the Porter Robinson fans, Porter Robinson and Maddie and fans. Like those people are crazy with prices. Like it's unbelievable at how much that people will fight over some certain stuff. Like it's crazy. Security breach? Oh my gosh, you know what? We need to play security breach one of these days. Like that's definitely on my to-do list. So we got that. We could always go for some more trivia. Yeah, I'm actually just kind of looking around now because I want to know if, in case if we ever miss anything. Okay, what's the cup about? Oh, that's a Ramley cup. Nothing beats the taste of fresh rambleberry juice drunk directly out of my plastic lifeless head. <laughs> well, he didn't have to put it like that. <laughs> Yeah, I think we're supposed to go here. Lloyd's main stage, the perfect performance. Lloyd live. Okay, cool. Well, chat, we already get to see Lloyd. Or at least we get to, right? Okay, so we're in the dark. Oh. Yeah, this game is made by a YouTuber. It, it's really crazy how, like, the concept started up in his head. Keep the papers on the stage. Run at him. I mean... Wait a minute. Is this guy alive? Wait. You saw his tail flip, right? He's <laughs> Okay, let, let's see what he's got to say about that. Hello. Oh, I don't think he. Uh, how is that a skill issue? What did I do? <laughs> what did I do? Okay, so. I already don't like the fact that he. Wait, isn't he supposed to be on two legs? Hey, buddy. I've got eyes all over the park, but I can't see anything behind the stage. If you're going back there, be careful. Your critter card is not yet able to resuscitate you. <laughs> Thanks for the input, Rambly. <laughs> okay, um... Okay, so we can't do that. <laughs> Disappointing. I don't know, like, oh. Ooh. Hey, this is a Bob chat. Yeah, you think like he probably went feral? Is that what happened? I am not cute, Darius, but welcome on in. The bluff welcomes you. How goes it, friend? Maybe it's a quadruped suit? Okay, so like, I actually gotta ask, cause like, are these guys like, are, are these robo characters or are they like actual like flesh and blood? Cause, I mean, that would make the most sense, right? For them to just be like... Stop it right now. I swear to God, I am going to turn you into K Kentucky Fried Chicken. Oh. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my. F Hi. Oh, chat, he is not a friendly camper. Oh my god, chat. Okay, yeah, he is not a friendly camper. I don't think he's friendly. Vitsy, I don't think... He... 
<laughs> I think you're gonna get destroyed, Vitsy, but not in the way that you think. <laughs> Y'all, I don't know, that that was pretty freaky. He was staring into my soul. Oh my god, I don't like this. Oh my god, I don't like it. <laughs> to Leo, I don't- Listen, but Leo is sentient, okay? Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, all of his clothes are gone. I think he did probably go feral, right? Okay. Oh, Jesus! Oh my god! You need to chill. Holy crap, that was literally so loud. What happened to you, buddy? Y you kind of fell off. I hope you know that. What do you mean? Dude, he fucking lunged at us. That That is enough of a view to get. What do you mean? Did you not see him, like, on all fours trying to fucking pounce us? Okay, what am I looking for here? Hello? <laughs> Listen, chat, I'm, s I'm sorry if I'm scared for my life right now, okay? Jesus, oh. Oh, wait, we're supposed to get the key. I don't think he was begging on all fours for affection. Oh no, you stop it right now. He's walking out there. You hear that? Shut up. Bitsy, shut up. <laughs> shut up. Like, I can hear him, like... Is he just waiting for me outside the door? Oh, I don't like it. Get up the Snickers. I don't think he's gonna... Terrified chat. I don't know where he's at. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it, chat. I don't like it. Don't do it. Oh, please don't do it. Mm, don't do it, don't do it. Yeah, we're fucking buff, look at that. Oh, Jesus. Hi. Hi, hello. Did you run off to?
Wait. Huh? Wait, what just happened? Does he does he not like the thing? Oh, the critter cuff probably scared him off. Okay, yeah, that's a Okay, yeah, so it's confirmed that Lloyd is completely feral. He is not a person anymore. Okay, look, look, it wasn't that bad, okay? This wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. But, I mean, that was pretty unsettling nonetheless. But where did he go, though? I would assume that he was probably back there. Doesn't look like there's anything left here. Maybe he's just scared of Rambly? Yeah, probably. Played through all of Echo if you're that scared of a cute He wasn't cute, okay? That is not Lloyd anymore. God, that, that still leaves so many questions as to, like, what happened to all of this here? Like, where did all this come from? He's taking a catnap. I can fix him. No, I don't think he can fix him, Bitsy. <laughs> Wait, didn't we just get one of these? Wait, I swear we just- we got that one, right? Did we just get two? I could've sworn we got another one, right? A pogo deal? <laughs> okay, now we can go to where we need to go. Bam. Jetstream Junction. Okay, so we're here. Why don't you check out Molly's rooftop races? It's not far from here, and it's a great warm up before we get into the bigger rides. Just take an up at Molly's landing pad. An up at Molly's landing pad. Okay, good to know. Pretzel dog? I mean, pretzel dogs would actually be kind of tasty, not gonna lie. Look at this whole area, though. Like, given if this place was still active, this could actually be like a really fun place to just hang out. Build your own bird... Burp burp? <laughs> Build your own burger. Barbecue bacon burger. Indigo special. Loaded hot dog. Not enough. Get it rambly style. Make it bigger. Hell yeah. Now you're talking. It's, it's truly the American restaurants, chat. <laughs> Okay, let's see. We got Astral Blast, Bubble Baron, Neutron Blast, Lyrical Wrecked, Seeking Soda. Okay, so this is root beer for damn sure. I'm not sure what these other ones are though. And then Water and Diet Water. <laughs> Move the hot dog and what do you get, Spitty? I mean, you get a dog, right? Am I missing a joke here? <laughs> I'm a huge bitch when it comes to scary games, so it's wonderful watching you play. Can't see, can't wait to see the later parts. Yeah, and again, thank you so so much for sticking around with me, for, even with the technical difficulties, because like that was kind of the make or break for stream tonight. Oh wait, oh you right? Yeah. No, Molly's plane crashed somewhere in Rambleberry Woods. Better find her, make sure she's okay. Oh. 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 Hi. Ow. It's so cool. We have a double jump. Oh, look at that, chat. It's like Sega. This is also really detailed for like an 8-bit game too, like look at this! You can see the geometry and the shadows there. Also there's the Undertale heart. Low main noodles? Yeah, I love low main noodles. <laughs> okay, uh... 
almost broke the game there. Yeah, look at us. Bam. Oh. Molly, what happened? Ugh, hey, Ramley. I was flying through the woods, but suddenly I couldn't see a thing. Looks like my smoke screen made a crash right on sight. Salem, I should have known you were behind this, you shady skunk. Let her go. Nah. <laughs> nah. How about I try to try my new potion on her instead? I'm tired of wasting it on squirrels. Molly, look out! Oh, she's evil. This game has an important plot point to it, I think. Yeah. Too slow, dumpster face. What? What did you do to her? Meet the new and improved Molly Macaw. Now with none of that friendship garbage stopping her from tearing you to pieces. I wonder what she really thinks of you now. Have fun finding out. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, it, it, oh wait, it's a boss fight. Oh. Oh, we, oh, we bap her on the head. We bonk her. Bonk. 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 Jesus! Low mayonnaise nuts. <laughs> you are such a dork. Also, wait, what is this? It's collectible. Oh, well that was worth it. Cool. Oh wait, this is where we need to go, right? All these landing pads? No. Uh, no, rooftop braces is where we needed to go. God, why is it so dark? Oh. No, this is horrible. Uh, looks like Molly crashed into the right again. Don't worry, though. Your pal Ramley has the repairman on speed dial. <laughs> <laughs> We're sorry. The number you have dialed has been disconnected or is no longer in service. Yep. Please check the number and dial again. Uh, say, why don't you check out Molly's landing pad? It's not far from here, and it's a great cooldown after that exhilarating ride. Just <laughs> take a down from Molly's rooftop races. Heck yeah, you know what? This ride... Kind of look boring anyway. Oh, it's a poodle. Okay, uh, that's another collectible. Did you grab the ramble bear? Yeah, I did. It's in our inventory now. That wasn't speed dial. I mean, I mean, depending on when this was, like, actually, yeah, what year is this? Come to think of it. Who did the follow? Bark, bark, bark. Oh. Fox Fluffington, thank you so much for the follow, friend. But bark! Okay, uh, right. What do we do here? This looks pretty lively, though. And I'm not cute. 20x. Okay, yeah, so it's a broken year. <laughs> Oh, it's one of these. Okay. Oh my god. Don't do this to me. Oh god. So I assume I'd have to find everything... Color wise, we have to match it with that. God, why do I have to do this? R remind me again who thought that this was a good idea. 
Okay. That was a lot closer than I thought you'd be. <coughs> Holy crap, I did not expect you to freaking sashay yourself over here and up there to wherever the hell it is you're going next. No, I'm not becoming cuter. Wait, you came here? Alright, well I'm gonna go in here, since you're all the way over there. These slides are also really big for whatever reason. <laughs> right, I'm going the other way. I think I'm going to go the other way. What do you mean I died from that? Hello? I, I don't think I want to follow the burb chat. Are you going to be up here too? Better not, I swear to god. Okay, don't do it. Okay, green triangle. Let's remember this chat. Green triangle. Green triangle, blue star. <gasps> Jesus Christ! You're not gonna be... Green triangle, blue star. A green triangle, blue star. Okay, I semi I semi hate this. <laughs> but it's so cool. Was there a red star? I didn't see a red star. Also, these slides are really big for us to be running around, don't you think? Like look at us. We're like we're walking in this. How big are these slides? I'm like watching my back now because I don't trust a damn thing about this place. Oh wait. Yellow circle. Where was the red star? Where was the red star you guys mentioned? I don't see it. Oh, is it really at the first tramp? Oh my god, you're right. I'm an idiot. Okay. Red star, yellow circle. Red star, yellow circle. Red star, yellow circle. Okay, so we were... Okay, so I did the order completely wrong. Red star, yellow circle. Red star, yellow circle. Okay, red star... Yellow circle. Oh, jeez. Ah. <laughs> Screw you. Okay, cool. Well, I guess we're going. Let's see. Oh, my God. What is this place? Oh, that just starts the music. Okay. Oh, no! 
going up. Okay, okay, yep, we going. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Yep, 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 yep. Oh jeez. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't think I want to play. Oh my god, she's fast. Holy shit, she is fast. God, okay, um, I don't know where I'm going. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know, I'm just running forward. Uh, I'm just running forward. Just running forward! Oh, jeez. Okay, well, in my defense, I didn't know you were caught by Molly Macaw. She can repeat words that she's heard. Don't be fooled. Okay. I don't know. That that hug was kind of sus, not going to lie. I'm going to turn Lloyd into a not virgin. Vitsy, I don't think that Lloyd is going to be very happy with you storming around his place. Okay, cool. Um... I actually don't know where I'm supposed to go in this part. Oh, we're supposed to go up here. Okay, that makes sense. So not back like I initially thought. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Um, um, um. Oh, oh, you? Hi. Okay, cool. Oh my god, she's in the vents with us. Um, I don't know where I'm going. I don't know where I'm going. Ah, there you are, Hi, can you can you save us? Wait, hold on. This won't on me. Um, how about you break the roof for once? Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Hi, 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 hi. Oh. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna, gonna gloss over. I can see in your facial tracking that you're scary, angry, upset. Transparency is an important part of our policy here at Indigo Park, so I need to be honest about something. The park has been inactive for years. Yeah, what? Stop showing up. Guests to the mascot, sir. I just was so excited to see a visitor, and I wanted to be sure you were given the best experience possible. Okay, can we talk about this, though, for a second? For so long, I didn't realize just how much disrepair the park has fallen into. Wasting all of your fun time. Eh, sorry for the inconvenience. Oh, chat. But, but, I have an idea. I have access to the repair documentation in my database. I just can't execute most tasks without authorization from a human user. You must have come here because the park matters to you too, right? Would you yeah. be willing to help me restore the park? Yeah, buddy. You see your facial tracking data that you aren't opposed to this. Oh, I'm so <gasps> excited. Let's get this place back in business. Oh my gosh, chat. <laughs> Look at him, he's so happy. <laughs> this adorable little shit. I love him. You see, like, his little tail wag, too? That's that's incredible. Also, oh, okay, so... What the hell is this? Like... So, obviously... Okay, so these things are confirmed to not be robots now. These things are... Organic creatures? Okay, so... So, wait, so then what the hell is this, then? Because, like... Actually, what is this? Is this a person in here? I mean, it doesn't look like it. Like, that neck is obviously way too big, but... They might be synths? On alchemy? Yeah, you, you, you can't just dump this whole thing on me and then just... Not give me answers? I don't understand. I mean, they could be a synth. Like, synthetics and robotic organisms, but like... I don't know about you, that this is pretty bloody and that is pretty organic.
Has anybody actually ever talked about this? Because the I expected them to be like all robots, like from the way how like their eyes were designed and how they moved. Well, I guess in Lloyd's case, he was more feral, so he he wasn't moving moving like really robotic, but she definitely was. Oh my god, Vitzy, he has a knoll. You shut it. <laughs> I'm genuinely curious because I think that is probably the most shocking factor in this whole story right now is that like these are 100% organic creatures of some sort. Okay, welcome to the crew, Rookie Wrangler. Register. Your first official job as one of Rambley's Wranglers. Register. Is to get out of the Rambley's Wranglers. Register. Room. <laughs> Head left towards the Rookie Wrangler. Register. Security room to set yourself free. Phew. Kind of exhausting to say that whole spiel. But Rambley's Wranglers register. There's a register trademark. <laughs> that expired yesterday. <laughs> Wait till the credits? Yeah, I'm really looking forward to this because like again, ooh. Are you a thing? No, you're not. Because again, I actually have no idea about any of this, but this seems really cool. Uh-oh. Rambley's Wranglers room is only accessible by Royal Wranglers. Maybe one day you'll grow up big and strong enough to enter it. But for now, don't. Don't. <laughs> okay, I wasn't even looking at that. I was paying attention to this. What are you? Okay, freaking bending in the ink machine. <laughs> Speaking of which, we also need to play through that game. But so far, this has been a really, really fun experience. I am into it. And <laughs> I'm into Lloyd. Vitzy, I don't think that Lloyd is very into you, though. Pixie? What are you talking about, heckin' beef? Welcome on in. The blep welcomes you. How goes it, friend? Cool. Um, is there anything else here? Okay, so I guess not. Okay. Oh, we got all the collectibles. Okay, I need to ask about this. It's a weird poodle plush. Doesn't seem to be an indigo product. Sure doesn't look like any characters you've seen in the parks. Maybe a child left it behind. A rambleberry. This thing popped out of the Rambly Rush arcade cabinet. How is this even possible? You think it's edible? A retro Lloyd plush. Okay, so that's what this is. I always find it weird when companies make merch that's supposed to look old. Lloyd obviously had an older look in classic indigo cartoons, but I'm not sure it looked like this. I guess nostalgia sells. Lloyd is more into me. I don't think he's into any of y'all chat. I think he he's just completely lost it now. Playing some Overwatch being gay. Ah, I see how it is, Pixie. You having fun over there? Having fun without me in the picture? <laughs> oh my god, you all are simping for Lloyd right now? Or degenerates? <laughs> If two vegans are arguing, it's considered having- Oh my god. <laughs> you guys are such dorks. Y'all are absolutely dorks. What? What did I do to deserve a skill issue this time? <laughs> I, I did nothing to deserve a skill issue. Okay. Let's see what the rest of these have to say. Whoa, where'd you find that? I've never seen anyone wearing one. Pretty snazzy. Ooh, looks like there's an audio recording tagged with costume in my database I've never noticed before. Let's listen, let's listen! Hey oh. Jackson, you hear about the new mascots? Yeah, think it'll put us out of a job? I think so. Old, sport, and right <gasps> after we got this damn raccoon costume. Man, screw this place. Wait a minute. I said we get our asses out of here and go straight to Vegas. Hold on a minute. I was really looking forward to that. What a useless recording. Deleted. I just had a holy shit moment right there, because if you didn't know what that audio recording was about, and like how old sport and Vegas was capitalized, I don't know if you guys have ever seen Day Shift at Freddy's. It's it's like a really funny shit post uh FNAF game. I think it's also made in Rempai. I I don't know, but like, the th this game is ancient. Okay, like you you had to be there to see it. Those lines of dialogue 
are a homage to that game. That is so funny. <laughs> oh no, Death Wolf, you, you summoned Vitzy. <laughs> okay, let's see what these other ones are about. Hey buddy, did you dig that out of the lost and found? Or was it in the trash? No surprise I guess that our park would dispose of a non-Indigo brand toy. I suppose he'd make playtime special for a child with poor taste though. Oh, come on, you didn't have to do them dirty like that. <laughs> Whoa, where'd you get that? Rambleberries are my favorite! Oh, if only I could jump out of the screen and take a big bite. Don't eat it! Then you'll be able to one day! <laughs> Chat, have you ever emphasized enough about how much I love Rambly? Like, honestly, I want Rambly to be our friend. Okay, let's see. I need to see what he says about this one. Uh, I don't get why we even have those. And why do they only make one of Lloyd? Is it because he's the loudest? I can be loud too! Oh. Where's my limited edition throwback plush? Where's Molly's? Where's Finley's? Give this mistake to a child and they'll cry. <laughs> Dude, the freaking shade! <laughs> Okay, I said this at the beginning of stream, but they need to expand upon the lore of Rambly and Lloyd in the later chapters, because I need to know what their beef is. <laughs> I need- I, I honestly need to know their beef. This is- this is hilarious. I agree, chapter 2 needs to be funded immediately. You're doing a great job, Rookie Wrangler! You'll find a puffer and porpoises, pickles, and perches as far as the eye can see. But please don't tap the glass. You never really know what might be in I don't think so. <gasps> oh! Okay, so we got to see him. Hey, you okay? You look kind of tired. Do you need a moment? Don't worry, it's fine. I don't blame you for taking a rest after all that. I could go for a nice, relaxing defragmentation myself. But before you settle down, you up for a little survey to help us improve the park? Thanks for visiting Indigo Park. Hope all your dreams Oh, it's got a song! If you've got some time and you're up for a lark, stick around for the Rambly Review. I'm here to offer my best to each valuable guest I assist. And lots of Aww. happy feedback ensures I get to exist. Were you satisfied with the rides? Yes or no? Were you satisfied with your guide? I sure hope so. Do you plan to come back? <laughs> Will I see you again? Did your experience convince you to tell a friend about us? Did I earn your trust at Indigo Park? Oh, this is so cute, chat. Also, Naki, hi. Welcome on in. Welcome. Welcome. The blood welcomes you. But out of the dark. Oh, this is so cool. This is so cool. But fight through the dark. And I'll be your spark of sunshine to get you out of Otter Boy V8. Wait, did they have a furry voice act for Rambly? I know all of this isn't fair to you. It's an awful lot to ask. But here comes Rambly Review Part 2 to sell you on Jake Neutron? Here to view and assess each valuable guest as I learn. Wait, I've s I swear I've seen them on Twitter like a bunch of times. I'm so happy you wrote a ride. I'm so happy to Oh my gosh, that's amazing. You know what? I'm following them shortly after this. At least I hope I do. At Indigo Park. There is a stark contrast to everything I know this place should be. This is so cute, chat. You've given a spark of sunshine to this kingdom's faithful devotee at Indigo Park. 
I know that my I don't have my VTuber stuff open, but I am bopping my head to this. Him. Oh, oh my gosh. This was amazing! Yeah, this game is such a cute horror game. Let's see. Thank you. Indigo Park is a full-on passion project that we've been working on on for a little over a year now. Yeah, this, this is crazy. I love it. The stories and world that we want to create with Rambly and his friends are very special to us. But with the scale of this game, we're going to need some help. If you enjoyed your experience with Chapter 1, consider supporting our socials if you want to see Chapter 2. No matter what happens, we enjoyed your stay. Thanks for visiting Indigo Park. Is that actually a hyperlink to... Oh my god, it About is! About a week ago, I announced Indigo... Yeah, okay, so... If you haven't already... Do be sure to give this guy a follow. This, this guy is the reason for Indigo Park's creation. Now time for the overall review of the game. I absolutely loved it. Um, I think the only thing that I would say was just the level of detail in the first part of the game, because, like, we ran into a couple of issues with that, but I think in the later chapters, you know, everything loaded in just fine. Again, this is a bug, and this game just came out, so, you know, bugs are to be expected. Overall, you know, like, I think that this is one heck of a fun experience, and I need to see more. Honestly, I, I really just need to see more of this game. Well, chat, that was Indigo Park. And again, holy crap, thank you to everyone that made this game possible. I'm really hoping that we get to see more. And yeah, that's Indigo Park. That's my review of the game. Definitely pick it up, definitely support them. And I cannot wait for chapter two.